Alright guys, hi and welcome to my channel. My name is Otto Rebel, and today I'm going to teach you how to use your channel points and create alerts such as this. It's taking me forever, freaking forever to figure out how to incorporate channel points into GIFs and alerts. And I think it's a great feature to have for your channel to create community engagement and just have funny things going on. I've got a lot of different options going on. Right now we're a community of Skyrim themed uh, gaming. So we have Melee Mode, Tell Me Lies, so and a few other ones that we sort of incorporate. And you can basically set it up with anything you want. So the first thing you want to do is you want to use, uh, you want to go to mix it up, uh, mix it up and I'll put the URL in the description below. And as far as I know, this works with Streamlabs OBS and OBS. I use it in Streamlabs OBS, uh, Streamlabs OBS blobs and I know a few others that use it on OBS. So I'm going to download the app. You can read the features and things like that. You can check out the app. It's really, really cool. Support Stream Deck and all these other things. And the next thing you're going to do is once the app is downloaded, you're going to set it up. So you're going to uh, sign in to the app, link your Twitch account and all the things. And the next thing you're going to start with is services. So under services, you have all these options. And the first thing that you want to do is you want to go to overlay. And you want to make sure that this URL over here, the localhost 81 the overlay is copied in. So you're going to just click it. And you want to make sure that you can uh, you copy that overlay over to your stream. So if I just take my screen here, you guys can see that right here. And if I take my Streamlabs over here, so I've got mix it up right here. And I've got that overlay right here. So when I click test overlay, what should happen is there, this can actually test. Now there is a stream pro recorder right here. There you go. So that's connected. So that's really, really important that you want to make sure that it's always connected before you start your stream. Otherwise it will never, it will never work. Uh, sometimes it has the issue where if you load up the app uh, after you open up your Streamlabs or recording software, it won't work. So you want to make sure that you open up Mix It Up first, and then you open up Streamlabs OBS, OBS, whatever comes, whatever you record with. Sometimes it doesn't work. So you have to refresh the cache uh, link, and it has the instruction here. Um, yeah, or OBS Studio, I guess, is a slightly different thing here in Streamlabs OBS. You can come here as well. I've just copied the overlay here. It's a lot, it's a lot easier for me to just do that. And the next thing you can do is you're going to go to uh, channel points and your channel points on your channel, which are our biggest stream right here. If you go into your rewards, channel points and rewards, because we have donuts, we have golden donuts. You want to make sure that the names matches up with source in that app app. So for right now, we're going to create a new uh, command and I'll show you an example. So we can use rebel exercise. So I'm going to right click, copy that. And what I'm going to do is right now we're under channel points. I'm going to add a new command, advanced commands, reward name, paste that in there. So that's the exact name. I do not change. I don't add anything here. And under actions, you can choose, yeah, all these different things. Chat messages to Discord to all these things. So chat message will just pop up saying something like, you know, whatever you kind of type in, text is peach. I'm going to select overlay, images, and video. I'm going to add, add that in. And then in five, I'll choose video. I'm going to browse. I've got a theme, mix it up, and I've got a video save for like right here. Now, I got to make sure the now, if you try and save, it will say uh, required information actions. So what it's asking you is here, it's asking you to select the duration of the clip you want it to be to match with the clip that you have added in there. Now, I know that the clip is 12 seconds long, so I'm just going to type in 12 seconds. I can play around with the sound, the position, the height, and everything else. Generally, I would recommend using Streamlabs OBS and just dragging and sort of enlarging things around. And then you would right click and add a filter for sound. You can always just kind of mute this a little bit higher or lower. So for now, I'm just going to take it to 30% it tends to be okay for me for now. And I'm going to click uh, save. That's it. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to close that up, go into my creator channel uh, dashboard back here. Okay, which is not person there shout out to the person hosting apparently and if i scroll down to channel points and i click rebel exercise should work <laughs> and that's basically it that's basically how you do it i mean it's it couldn't get any simpler it's taken me about a couple months to actually figure out how to do it. And apparently mix this is a mix it up bot that used to work with uh, mixer and 
not a lot of people know this feature sort of exists and that you can make it work and it's way simpler than trying to integrate a loyalty system with streamlabs or something else or redeem a gif or something like that it's super simple super easy to use and super easy to set up so guys feel free to like subscribe and share the video uh if there's any comments or feedback you have any questions let me know i'd appreciate it and i'll check you out on my twitch channel come say hi if the video boarded over yeah thank you very much for watching catch you next time